Hello and welcome to the Stuart Turner Monsoon Range Pressure Switch Replacement video. This video will guide you through step by step the process of changing a pressure switch on a monsoon pump. With the electrical supply isolated, a decision will have to be made as to whether the pressure switch change can be done with the pump in situ or the hose is removed and the pump moved to a more accessible location. The next thing you will need is a pressure switch service kit like the one I have here. This will contain all necessary parts needed to change the pressure switch on your pump. Pressure switch kits can be ordered on the Stuart Turner website or by calling Pump Assist. It is worth noting that the replacement pressure switch you receive could differ from the old one as they are constantly being updated. The first step in replacing your pressure switch is to remove the pressure vessel on the pump and the fibre washer that seals it to the manifold. This fibre washer and any remnants stuck to the brass must be completely removed in order to create a good sealing face for the new fibre washer. The next step is to undo the terminal box lid by undoing the four screws. With the terminal box removed, the cable clamp holding the pressure switch wire can be undone. Ensure that a note is made of the orientation of the cable clamp because it will need to be replaced in the same way later on. Now the pressure switch wire has been identified, it is time to remove the wire from the PCB terminal block fitting by unscrewing the securing screws. The pressure switch wires may consist of two brown wires or a blue and a brown wire as shown here. To fully remove the pressure switch wire from the terminal box, simply pull the wire through the rubber gland on the side of the terminal box. Next we must undo the pressure switch itself. First loosen the pressure then switch Then unscrew the, the pressure switch fully by hand. Once removed, discard the pressure switch and the bonded seal. Now for reassembly. First place the bonded seal onto the pressure switch and screw into the manifold assembly. Tighten the pressure switch to a torque of 7 to 8 newton meters using a spanner. Now to reconnect the pressure switch to the PCB. First push the pressure switch wire through the gland on the side of the terminal box and pull any excess wire through. Next reconnect the pressure switch wires to the PCB terminal block. It doesn't matter what way round they go just as long as they go in the terminals marked S1. After connection, ensure all wires are safely tucked out of the way of the terminal box lid and are routed so they miss all components on the PCB. Next, replace the cable clamp. Replace the cable clamp in exactly the same orientation as and noted tighten earlier. the screws to a torque of 0.8 newton meters. Now replace the terminal box lid, again securing the screws to a torque of 0.8 newton meters. The final step is to place a new fibre washer into the manifold assembly and screw back on the pressure vessel, ensuring it is hand tight. And your monsoon pressure switch replacement is complete.